G'day mates, Red Fox here, and uh, welcome to Skyrim. Oh, uh, hello there. Today, uh, I'm thinking, I'm thinking uh, you guys, uh, I've made an actual video in like a, uh, a long time. Okay, so I was thinking maybe I should show you a new game, because I really think that uh, my other games, I, I don't play at all anymore. What I do play now is a, a game most like... Wait a minute. Skyrim. And it's not just any Skyrim, guys. This is the PS4 Special Edition Skyrim. Basically, I can get lots more shit with this game way thingy. And I've, I've already played, as you can see, I've played a lot of this game. Uh, I've got lots of shit. Uh, if you see here, I have a crossbow. I have a nice old uh, friend here. Let's get going. Uh, and uh, she's uh, she's Lead my wife. On, and uh, and uh, I got a crossbow, which is pretty good. I already mentioned the crossbow, didn't I? Fuck. Anyway, so I've completed not most of the story because fuck, the story's pretty boring. But instead, I, I've just been working on doing other shit, like, um, side quests. And collecting followers. And collecting friends. Talking of friends, I now have a permanent friend. Where's my permanent friend? Permanent friend. Dead throw, flame throw. That's what I want. I favorite that one, actually. Yeah. I now have a permanent friend, which I like to call Mr. Flamethrow, or Miss Fr Flamethrow. This does look like a uh, woman, but it is a fire woman. And what's really cool about this is it stays with me until it dies, and it's pretty weak, so... Uh, yeah, enough said. <clears throat> In this episode, I'm thinking I would wish to... Get a, another thing done. Taking care of business. Blah, 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 blah. Return to your roots, blah, blah, blah. The Fallen talks to the Yarl of Whiterun, blah, blah, blah. So the Transmondan, the Break of Dawn, Pieces of the Past. First Lessons, Prophet, Dragonborn, Travel to Solstheim, Prophet. Okay, that's what we want to do. <clears throat> We're going to continue our Dawnstar uh, main story. And I just got to find a way to get up to. Oh, there it is. Stairs. <clears throat> now, just to catch you guys up on what's been happening on this place, I uh, I met a vampire woman who was all cool because I, I freed her from her little uh, prison. I brought her back to her father. Her father was all like, "Yo, you want to become a vampire?" I was like, "Nah, man, I'm a van I'm a werewolf right now." So I was like, "Yo, man." So I was like, oh yeah, mate, fuck off, I'll let you live this time because you saved my daughter, but I really care about my daughter, I only care about the Elder Scroll that she brought me back as a souvenir, nice, mate. So I was all like, yo, fuck you, mate, I'm gonna go back to Dawn Guy, I'm gonna bring all, like, the whole squad in here, just to go whip on your nanes. And, uh, yeah, we're back here, we've got two extra allies who, um, gave me this sick-ass crossbow that I mentioned earlier, and uh, now we just gotta follow this guy here. Hello. I knew it would come to this one day. Yes. I knew, and no one believed. <clears throat> his voice makes me cringe. Like, his voice is actually just. I know what I'm doing. I'm Morgan Freeman, but not as cool. This vampire showed oh. up while you were away. She's the woman I'm afraid. I'm guessing it's the one you found in Dim Hollow Crypt. Yeah, I freed her from a. something really important to say to you. Oh, okay, cool. What so is it? let's hear it. What's up, Probably weren't expecting to see me again. Actually, no, I wasn't. What are you doing here? I'd rather not be here either, but I needed to talk to you. It's important, so please just listen before okay. your friend here loses his patience. Hey, Morgan it's... Freeman over there. Well, it's about me oh. and the Elder Scroll that was buried with me. I can see it on your back there. What about the scroll? The reason I had it and why I was down there. It all comes back to my father. I'm guessing you figured this part out already, but my father's not exactly a good person. No. Even by vampire standards. Oh. He wasn't always like that, though. Really? There was... a turn. 
He stumbled onto this obscure prophecy and nice. just kind of lost himself in it. Nice. Okay. What What is this prophecy you speak of? It's pointless and vague, like all prophecies. The part he latched onto said that vampires would no longer need to fear the sun. Whoa. That's what he's after. He wants to control the sun. No way. And vampires control the world. Anyway, my mother and I didn't feel like inviting a war with all of Tamriel, so bad. we tried to stop him. That's why I was sealed away with a scroll. What does all this have to do with Dawn God? I'm sorry. I had heard there were vampire hunters here. I thought they might right, want to yeah, know about right, a vampire shit. plot to enslave the rest of the world. Well, was I wrong? I'm kind of freelance, but uh. <clears throat> Why do you, so you're saying you want us to like help you kill you, your papa? That was the plan, yes. Assuming the rest of them can trust a vampire. Come yeah. on, I'll need you to help convince them. Alright, cool. Alright, Isran, this woman, she doesn't like sunlight. We should give her some, some like, uh, some, uh, what's it called? Uh, sun, uh, sunscreen. Get her some nice sunscreen, slip, slap, slop. Got, uh, everything. All right, you've heard what it has to say. Now it. tell me, is there any reason I shouldn't kill this blood-sucking fiend right now? This blood-sucking fiend. We're going to need her help. Set your hatred aside and try to see a lot of hatred. Okay, <clears throat> because we're going to need her help. Why? Because of that story about the prophecy about some vampire trying to put the sun out? Yeah. Do you actually That's... believe any of that? Well, why else would she risk her life coming here? Who knows? Maybe it has a death wish. Maybe it. it's just insane. I don't really care. It can stay for now. But if it so much as lays a finger on anyone here, I'll hold you responsible. Oh, me. Got it. You hear me? Don't feel like a guest because you're not. Oh, I like how he just, he's talking to her, but he pointed at me. He's like, you hear me? In the meantime. What, me? Don't talking about? me regret my sudden outburst of tolerance and generosity. Because oh, if you do, shut up. Budget your Morgan Freeman is going to pay for it. Me. Thank you for your kindness. She's not my friend. She's uh. Next time I'm feeling hungry. She's so, uh. In case you didn't notice the giant thing on my back, I have the Elder Scroll with me. Yeah, I noticed Whatever that. Whatever it says, it will have something that can help us stop my father. I have an Elder Scroll too. But we of can course, be Elder Scroll buddies. neither of us can read it. I can read it. Well. The moth priests are the only ones I've heard of who can do it. Okay, they spend years it, preparing before cool. they start reading, though. Not that it helps us anyway, because they're all half a continent away. In Cyrodiil. We could ask the great, Some great boys. imperial scholar boys. arrived in Skyrim a few days ago. I was staking out the road when I saw him pass by. Maybe that's your moth priest. No, he's trying to do help us out. Do you know where he's staying now? No. And I'm not going to waste men looking. We're fighting a war against your kind. And I intend to win it. Nice. You want to find him? Try talking to anyone who'd meet a traveler. Innkeepers and carriage drivers in the big cities, maybe. But you're on your own. Any idea how you're going to find a moth priest? Skyrim's a pretty big place. Okay. Where would a moth priest actually go? Well, back before I... You know... The College of Winterhold was the first place I think to go for any kind of magic or historical thing. Nice. The nice. wizards know about all kinds of things that people probably shouldn't know about. Wizards! <clears throat> I... Well, I'd come with you, but I don't know if I can trust your friend. My friend? Let me know if you want me along. Isran or Ayala? Is this a... Are you talking about Ayala? I mean, she's really powerful, like... If you want to Serana... Along, it has to just be me and you. Has to just... I'm sorry, Ayla. Don't get. I'm still here. <laughs> I'm still here. Yep. Uh, don't get jealous, okay? Don't get. Need. Don't don't get jealous. Uh, cause I'm cause I'm chilling out with. Where'd she you. go? What? Help! She yes, ma'am. She was, and now she. What? I. And then, what the shit? Yes, love. I turn around for one second and she just disappears. All right. Well, I, I might need your help again. Yes, love. Since uh, she uh, she kind of left. Okay. 
Follow me. Let's I need your help. Any time. Good idea. Let's go. Let's go. Where'd she go? One second she was there. I was like, don't don't mind me if I'm going to chill out with. Okay, she's not there anymore. Okay, it's fine. I'm I'm good with that. I'm good with that. You don't you don't have to stay. Okay, you don't have to stay. <gasps> oh, there you are. If you want to come along, it has okay. to just be me and you. Is my friend to come here? Just stay stay here. Okay, stay here. All right. You. Let's get going. Powers. I'm heading home. If you need me. And then, she's there. Hello. Are you looking for me? Do you still want to come? Of course. Let's go. Right, let's go. Don't arouse any. I'm pretty sure if I bring her along with me, she might get attacked in like places. But don't worry, we have we have my uh, flamethrower here with us, so you know, we all should be just gonna stare at that door the whole day, or you're just gonna you know walk through there. Now that took a while. Okay, open up out to Spring Canyon. We need to get to the College of Winterhold, and good. Thing, guys, I know exactly where the College of Winterhold is. I've been there th three times. Th two times? Once. Yes, love? Yes, once. At least once. At least one time I've been there. See, look, look, I, I, I've discovered it. Don't need to worry about us, guys. I'm a professional. Oh, hello. Oh, I've met you before. You, I, I asked you about the you. other. Hundreds Dragons. of years have gone into assembling this collection. Nice. It's going to stay pristine, understand? I need to find a, uh, um, a moth priest. A moth priest? What in oblivion do you need a moth priest for? Catching moths. Fine, fine. No need to get your britches in a twist. The obvious answer is to go to the Imperial City. The moth priest make their home in the White Gold Tower. Sometimes they go out looking for Elder Scrolls. Lucky for you, there's a moth priest in Skyrim right now, doing just that. Nice. He stopped in to do some research in the library, then left for Dragon Bridge. If you hurry, you might catch him there. Let's go. I know where Dragon Bridge is. The sound. Holy shit, that is a big moon. I'm kind of gaunt daunted by that moon. Hey, you! Get back here. Hey, you! What? Oh, okay. Who's there? Unfortunate. Ah, oh, not again. Go for it, Serana. Do it. Yes. This is the second dragon I've had to fight in fr in this godforsaken place. Honestly, can't this place just call themselves like something other than Dragon Bridge? I, I, I get the I get the feeling Dragon Bridge just draws a lot of attention. Uh, this is gonna take a while. Like. Uh, is it going to take a while though? Hang on, I have Dragon Rend. Dragon Rend, Dragon Rend. Where's my Dragon Rend? Dragon Rend. Dragon Rend? Dra oh, there it's Dragon Rend. I'm just blind. Dragon Rend! Get down here, son. We're going to have a nice little chat, just you and me, okay? Okay, don't let on me, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> I try to get him to get a bit closer this time. Come on, we got this, guys. I've been fighting dragons since that one ep that one level where I had to save this West Bridge in Went White Run. A lot of details. Don't even have to go into them right now. Heal up. Oh no, please don't, please don't, please don't, please don't. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. You know, I think maybe next time I won't just run in there and uh, stand in front of his frost beam. That, 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 that'd work better next time if I didn't do that next time. Night time. Everybody knows nobody's awake in night time. Let's wait uh, 12 hours. 12 hours seems about right. Your hands are cold. Your movements are lifeless. You want more speed. You're feeling restless. 12 hours later, and we have just seen a new day. Seen some mean Hello. Have you met my husband? 
Well, don't but bother. Of He's a drop. Drop. Shut up. I don't care. Know anything about nah, a moss priest? I don't think moth so. Moth priest. Okay, thank you. Until next time. You. So Welcome, traveler. Mind yourself. You know anything about a moth priest? Moth priest? I'm sorry, but I don't know anything about that. Oh, okay. Try asking one of the guards. <gasps> the guards. That's right, right those then. guards. Huh? Oh, for fuck's sake! Uh, I thought my death would scare it away. Okay. No, just stay right there. Just don't come near me, okay, mate? Just stay right there. Nobody needs to get hurt. At least of all you, okay? Nobody needs to get hurt. Okay, just, just, okay, never mind. He's coming for me. All right. <clears throat> How about the... You're gonna, you're gonna come down or you're just gonna chill up there for a while? For some reason, every time I go to Dragon Bridge... Where are you guys going? Guys? Okay. Alright, guard. Guard. No. Guard. You. The dragon ran away. Okay, let's talk. God, my Only thing about a moth priest? So that was a moth priest then. He mm. rode through town not long ago with an escort of soldiers. Oh, nice. They didn't stop, just headed south, across the Dragon Bridge. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. Investigate the scene of the attack. Oh, of course it's been the freaking attack here. Uh, oh! Oh, a vampire. A vampire's note. Gold. Thank you very much. I am been needing this. Vampire does tend to be invisible. Read the vampire's note. Let's do this. <clears throat> Books. Uh, uh, vampire's note. Vampire's note. Vampire's note. Vampire's note. Here it is. The bottom. Nice. <clears throat> I have new orders for you. Prepare an ambush just south of Dragon Bridge. Take the moth priest to Four Bears Holdout for safekeeping. Until I can break his will, Malchus. Okay. Looks like we're gonna have to go bust this dude out of prison. But before we do that, I just wanna see what this guy's got. No, he's got any money, is he? Oh, a horse. Can I search you? Oh, horse meat. Yeah, of course. Special path. Jitsu. Alright, now. <clears throat> My guess is that this is going to be another one of those scary caves that I'm going to use a lot of stupid st stuff for. Oh, Jesus. Serana? Okay, never mind. To Four Bears Hideout. There are always human cattle in Castle Volkiha that can vampire can feed on. Feeding reduces sun damage, but also weepen weakens your vampiric powers. Oh, okay, so I don't eat stuff. Unless you want to get, like, burnt in the process. Alright. Quiet now, Serana. And Flame Atronach. Let's go. Maybe I should run a bit faster. Okay, let's go. We must be very quiet, guys. Any wrong missteps and we could find ourselves face-to-face -face with a death hound. Whatever they're called. I don't know. You see, vampires themselves are really weak, but these guys, these little death hounds, they are... <clears throat> Let's just say they're not something you want to be face to face with. Hey. Woman. Woman. Did you just... She froze me for a second there. Huh? Yes. Yes! This is teamwork. Hey, could, you, could you not push me into the side of those wall, please? This is teamwork, you know what I'm saying? These things look like they're out of like an anime or something. That's what that's that's the textures that they've got. So Death Hounds, they're they're probably more powerful than vampires themselves at this point. So uh just be careful with them. I don't really care if we run into vampires, vampires are weak as shit, but Death Hounds, they're uh <laughs> Death Hounds are uh, 
Oh, let's just say you don't want to be messing with them dead hounds. Please don't come alive on me, gargoyle. I don't want to have to use the beast powers. My vision's getting blurred. Yes, get him. Get him, Serrano. I'll just stand here and watch. Yes, Serrano. Yes, Serrano. Okay, you passed the test. You definitely passed the test. You definitely weren't, like, uh, that good earlier. But now you, now you look better. Why, hello there. This is me. Eat that pussy for for <laughs> Nah. Okay, let's just do this. <clears throat> All right, I will lead the way, boys and, and girls. I mean, because technically they're both vampire fledgling. You are my mortal e enemy. Oh, well, that was quick. Uh, no. Could you could you not come back to life? Oh no, you're you're bringing him back to life. Well, in that case, hey, Malchus, 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 could you not zap me? Hey, Vampire Fledgling, would you not cut me, boy? Girl? I really need to get these genders on down pat. Get him! Get oh, okay. That was nice. I, I just stood here and watched you guys defeat him. I kind of feel bad for not doing shit for you guys, but... Oh, well. Tit, tit for tat. Uh, Waystone Focus. That sounds interesting. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay, there it is. Probably gonna need it. Ah! Uh. Ow! What the fuck, Richard? Oh, you're there. I couldn't even see you. That's how interesting that was. Oh, this is it. Bitch. Okay. Now that now that we've um <clears throat> now that I've warmed up, I'm feeling very much more inclusive in these battles. Like before, I wasn't doing anything. I was just leaving you guys to do all the work. I suppose it's safer for me, because I, I die real easy. Deactivate the magic barrier. Hang on, that's the moth priest. Moth priest, are you okay, my dude? Oh, you're not the moth priest. Oh, you're just evicting. Oh, have you seen the moth priest? I'm looking for the moth priest. Can you tell me where the moth priest is? Excuse me, can you tell me where the moth priest is? Oh, shit, okay, you're killing me, okay. Help me out here, guys. I can't do all the work this time. Oh, actually, actually technically you guys are doing all the work. Okay, that's it. Great, that was Dragon Rend. You are an idiot. Uh, can't believe I'm using potions of healing. Wow. Okay, what I want was my fire breath. Thank you very much. Please. That's my... Okay. Thank you for burning me, piece of shit. Okay, uh, okay, thank you for... Treating me with a that, bomb. I owe you a debt for the timely rescue. Oh, you're the moth priest? Oh, sorry about this, but <sighs> what do you know about Elder Scrolls? <clears throat> Not as much as I would like. Oh, Even after great. spending decades of my life in study, I'm just shouting just to get to what against you. Can you? I'm true for most of my brothers in the order as well. I don't, I don't really know where the scrolls came from or who wrote them. What do you know about? I can't get some are born with a special gift to read the Elder Scrolls. Nice. These chosen few can divide events in the past and future. Mm -hmm. You can join this. Okay, I already got it. It's right. To blindness. I'm afraid there's not much more to tell. Even today, the Elder Scrolls remain a great enigma. Okay. Are you okay, my dude? <sighs> I'm quite all right. Thanks to you. Dexian Evicus is my name. Oh, nice. I'm a moth priest of the White Gold Tower. These vampires claim they had some purpose in store for me, but they wouldn't say what. Probably hoping to ransom me, the fools. Okay. I know why they need you. Because <clears throat> we need you. You do? All right then. Enough mysteries. All right. <clears throat> We're called the Dawn Guard, and we need you to read an Elder Scroll. You have an Elder Scroll? I have two. We have two. If my knowledge of history serves me, I recall that the Dawn Guard was an ancient order of vampire hunters. Okay. I will be happy to assist you with your Elder Scroll. I would be happy Just to tell me where I need to go. All right. <clears throat> you can find us at Fort Dawn Guard near Stendars Beacon. Here, give me, give me a paper. All right. I'll, I'll give me a map. I'll, I'll mark it on the map. Very well. 
I'll hurry on my way there before more of those vampires turn up. Good idea. You're very smart, okay? Leaving it to the professionals, as you know. I'm just not very happy that there's like lots of freaking gargoyles around. Like, I'm very wary of these. I do not like gargoyles. They are my least favorite enemy in the entire game. I'm not lying. Like, gargoyles, I absolutely hate them. They're like, <clears throat> like gargoyles, they're not usually actual enemies. They're just conjurations of the vampires. Like, vampires love to conjure them. And they're just really overpowered. In fact, the only way I can defeat them easily is when I turn in, when I use the beast blood. But without that, it's, well, it's kind of hard. Yeah. Oh, well. That uh, went about as great as I could have thought. Hello. I'm impressed you could find a moth priest so quickly. Alright. Does he have the scroll? For the reading? Yeah. Nice. Just let the old man know when you're ready. Okay, cool. Cool. So, wait a minute. If he has a scroll, then what's it doing on Serana's back? Oh, you can sit on this? You can't sit on this. Oh, you lied to me. Hello. Ah, oh, hello there. I like how it says, glad you made it here safely, Dexacon. It's as if I'm trying to be nice to this guy, but I really don't care. I just want to say, okay, what does it say? But no. Glad you made it here safely, Dexacon. I see you ah, have a good time. my rescuer. It's good to see you again. Are you just... Okay, nice. <clears throat> have my companions made you feel welcome? It's not exactly the hospitality I'm used to, but your man Isran has seen to my needs well enough. Nice. And might I add, this is a remarkable fortress. I have colleagues back oh, home. I don't I'll care. This place in detail. Okay. Are you prepared to read the Elder Scroll? Oh, most certainly. Let's find out what secrets the scroll can tell. Now. If everyone will please be quiet. Wait a minute. Must concentrate. I see a vision. This is Illuminati. Ooh. An okay. image of a great bow. I know this weapon. It is Oriel's bow. Oh. Now a voice whispers, saying, Among the night's children, a dread lord will rise. In an age of strife, when dragons return to the realm of men, Darkness will mingle with light. But the night and the day will be as one. That sounds like the voice nowadays and the words begin to shimmer and distort. But wait, there is more here. The secret of the bow's power is written elsewhere. I think there is more to the prophecy, recorded in other scrolls. Yes, I see them now. One contains the ancient secrets of the dragons, and the other speaks of the potency of ancient blood. My vision darkens, and I see no more. To know the complete prophecy, we must have the other two scrolls. I must rest now. The reading has made me weary. Come on, old man. You should get some rest. Um... Uh, not really, but okay. Okay, what's in your mind? That moth priest, Dexian. He said we needed two other Elder Scrolls. Yes. I think I know where we can start looking. Find Elder Scroll Dragon. I already have the Elder Scroll Dragon. Why did you? Why what didn't you say? people in your little crew would just as soon kill me as talk to me. That doesn't exactly make me want to open up. Yeah. I got a warmer welcome from my father. Not saying something. He, he, he boy. Okay. You're not talking at all. Just, that's a nice sword. Just saying. Looks nice. Uh, does Harkin even care about you anymore? Okay. Uh, what is it between you two? Ever since he decided to make that prophecy as calling, we kind of drifted apart. I don't even think he sees me as his daughter anymore. I'm just a means to an end. Okay. So where is this other Elder Scroll? We need to find my mother, Valerica. She'll definitely know where it is. And if we're lucky, she actually has it herself. Nice. You said you didn't know where she went. The last time I saw her, she said that she'd go somewhere safe. Somewhere that my father would never search. Other than that, she wouldn't tell me anything. But the way she said it, someplace he would never search. It was cryptic, yet she called attention to it. Okay, I'm glad you have really good memory, but... It's, uh, it sounds like she was being cautious. 
Maybe. What I can't figure out is why she said it that way. I don't Besides, know. I can't imagine a single place my father would avoid looking. Um, and he's had all this time, too. Any ideas? Hiding with the Dawn Guard? So do I where you are in Castle Rock. <laughs> Hiding with the Dawn Guard? They'd be even less welcoming to her than they've been to me. It would have been a bloodbath. And since the Dawn Guard are still around, that must not have happened. Okay, so... Ideas? Sealed away like you were, or in castle, but what are you waving your aunt? Okay, never mind. Uh, sealed away like you were. I don't think so. She said she wanted to stay awake in case the situation was resolved. Good. It had to be one of us, and well, she's so much more powerful than I am. Nice. It just made sense for her to be out here. Anything else? Um, it could be in Castle Volkia. Wait, that almost makes sense. There's a courtyard in the castle. I used to help pretend a garden there. All of the ingredients for our potions came from there. She used to say that my father couldn't stand the place. Too peaceful. Uh, isn't that pretty risky? Well, I mean, like, Absolutely. It's, 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 but my mother's not a coward. That is, I don't think we'll actually trip over her there, but it's worth a look. Uh, well, uh, but they're not going to let us through the front door. I mean, last time I was there, he kind of he kind of told me he was going to eat me. So, I mean, True. Like, but I know a way we can get to the courtyard without arousing suspicion. Oh. There's an unused inlet on the northern side of the island that was okay. used by the previous owners to bring supplies into the castle. Good. An old escape tunnel from the castle exits there. Nice. I think that's our way in. Uh-huh. All right, let's do it. It's around the side of the castle. Let's move. <sighs> okay. Think I might end this episode here, guys. We didn't really get too much done. But like oh, in figure saying figuratively speaking, but we have got uh, it's been it's been it's been a long episode. Like we've done a decent amount of stuff, and this is just the beginning. Okay, guys, we're gonna, we're gonna, you're gonna be seeing a lot more Skyrim videos in the future, and I, I'm sorry I couldn't show you my ultimate beast form in this episode, but I, I feel like the beast form is pretty useless against vampires because I can't eat them well, unless I get. Upgrades and stuff, but I'm oh, great. I'm stuck. Okay, no, I'm not stuck. Okay, but I think I'll see you guys in the next one if there is a next one. So, uh, bye bye. Have a nice time.